What I know is that people love Lori. What she represents, I think, for people is survival. You came here to kill me, so do it. Courage, tenacity, perseverance, kindness, fearlessness, protection, all of the things have been sort of poured into Lori Strode, and I'm Lori Strode. So I get that everywhere I go. And I feel really lucky to step into something that I've been a fan of like my entire life. I love horror movies. Um, Halloween's always been my favorite. I mean, it feels like such a blessing to step into a legacy this big. It still hasn't fully sunk in, and I've been in this world for five years. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, so it never changes. <laughs> it okay, never changes. Cool. It never gets better. And even then, I think I'm going to look back on it in years to come and just feel like it was a fever dream, getting mm -hmm. this kind of once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. People like to be scared. I know that the innocence of Lori and the... Uh, uh, evil of Michael colliding in the 1978 movie by establishing this sort of town, real town, every American town, that that collision between the two of them in 1978 did start something. Like when I was 11 or 12 and saw the movie for the first time, it, it, it really messed me up. And to be able to have both that anxiety and that enthusiasm about something is, is a specific flavor of adrenaline that I had in my youth and I've tried to bring some of that to what I'm actually making. I don't even theorize what makes Michael tick. You know, I, I, and, and I wanna just make sure that the motivations are not emotional. The closest we did is we said he wants to go home. I want him to be anonymous, faceless. You know, there's moments where we might see him without a mask, but you're not looking him in the eyes, you're not getting any expression, you're, no, you're never gonna get an emotion, and you're never going to get any humanity out of him. The second I read the script, I was just amped to do it because it's a wild, wild script. It's a big swing and it has a huge payoff and it's um, the epic kind of conclusion that everyone's been waiting 44 years for.